everybody, welcome back. My name is Amari Andrew, and today I'm gonna to show you how to make one of my absolute favorite Christmas mocktails. This one's called the Christmas wreath. This one's made especially for all my wonderful peeps that really just don't like super sweet things. It has a lovely cranberry, rosemary, hint of sweetness to it, and a little bit of lemon, and it looks gorgeous. It's one of my absolute favorites. Let's just get to it, because my ice is actually starting to melt, I think, from all my hot breath. Before I get started, I always do this, but before I get started, this entire recipe is gonna be on my website at amaraandrew.com. Link right there and in the description below. And then I'm also gonna be making a bunch of other mocktail recipes. They're gonna be coming out all throughout December. So head to my channel to see all of them. There's gonna be a mixture of like this, which is more of like an earthier kind of taste and then some sweeter like cookie sort of ones. What the hell else do I have? I don't know. There's just like a cacophony of flavors. So go check them out on my channel and yeah, you can see whatever kind of holly jolly bullshit I come up with. Anyway, let's just get to the mocktail. First, what you're gonna do, you're gonna take a mixing vessel and put some ice cubes in there. Um, I just have this one just because I like it and it has a little pour spout. I've kind of upgraded from ball jars a little bit, not entirely, but just a little bit. So throw some ice cubes in there. Then what you're gonna do is you're gonna take four ounces of cranberry juice and pour that right in there. Then you're gonna take one ounce of lemon juice, freshly squeezed by me. And then we're gonna take one ounce of rosemary simple syrup. This has been honestly my favorite thing. I've been drinking it, like, not like from the bottom. Actually. That's so sweet. <coughs> oh my God, why did I do that? That was so stupid. Why am I washing it down with coffee? Ugh, that was so sweet. I don't know why I was like, I actually haven't tried it on its own, so let's just try it. Well, if you really like sweet shit, you will love that. Ooh. Anyway. <laughs> okay, so you can take a sip if you'd like, but I kind of don't recommend it because it's really, really sweet. Oh my God, I'm gonna have like a fucking cavity now. Anyway, not super sweet in the drink, which is really good. So I've actually been adding this to just like Topo Chico or just like my regular water, just because I like a little hint of it. I didn't make a ton, so it's not like I like drink this whole thing. It's been really, really good. So just FYI, if you like earthier, sweet kind of things, then this is good. Just don't drink it straight. Or if you really like sweet things, then drink it straight. Whatever floats your boat, no judgment. So what you're gonna do is take one ounce of rosemary simple syrup and pour that in there as well. And you can do one to two, depending on how sweet you like to make things. Like I just demonstrated, I don't really like sweet things as much anymore. So I'm just gonna kind of lay low a little bit. Uh, then what you wanna do is just mix it, um, just to kind of incorporate your flavors. I normally do like, I feel like I'm like ringing the dinner bell. Dinner time! Whoa. Oh man, I'm gonna get such a sugar rush from that now. And I'm drinking coffee. I don't really drink coffee. It's like two or 3 p.m. Yeah, it's like 3 p.m. I don't really drink coffee this late. I try to not drink coffee ever anymore just because like liver problems, blah, 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 which is also why I don't drink anymore. Sorry, that's probably really annoying. You probably can't hear me at all. But yeah, I try to not drink coffee this late, but I felt like I needed a little bit of pep in my stuff today. And especially cause I'm like recording this right now. So here we are. So mix it, um, Norm, I do like 15 to 30 seconds. I don't know, I, I wasn't even fucking counting. I was just talking to you, honestly. How's it going? How's your day? Okay, so that's all mixed. Lick off your spoon. Oh, damn, that was really good. Did I even say what I, I think I said what I put in it, but if not, it'll be on the screen. Then you're just gonna take a highball glass, put some ice cubes in there, and then just pour your mixture. Oh wait, no, no, no. Before you do that, you are gonna take your highball glass with ice cubes in it and put some frozen cranberries in there. Ooh. So this is gonna help keep your drink cool without watering it down too much. Like you want some ice cubes in there cause it will be a little bit tartar. I was gonna say tartar, but that sounded weird. But this will also just look really pretty. So we'll just pour some of their, those in there. There and those, whatever, you know what I mean. So pour some of those in there and then you're gonna pour your mixture into your glass. Put that off to the side. And then this is what gives it kind of the Christmas wreath sort of name. Well, also the rosemary simple syrup, but this is just fresh rosemary that we're gonna throw in there. I mean, you could throw it if you want. I just gently place it, but yeah, whatever. Just gonna pop that in there. I'm gonna do like two. Ooh, that one's like artfully off to the side. Let's see. So I'll just kind of pop those in there. I don't know, it looks really pretty. And like when you have the cranberries in there too, it just looks nice if you can see that. Ooh! or you can see down here. <laughs> so I just really like the colors and everything. And then final step, just top it with some Topo Chico to like 
calm down, mellow out the flavor a little bit and add a little bit of dynamism with the, the poppy bubbles as they call them. And then just kind of stir it with your straw a little bit. And then you are all set. So there you have it, the Christmas wreath. It looks so pretty. I really love just like the red color, the dynamism, the little bit of rosemary popping out and shit like that. So let's take a sip. Oh, that's so good. I love that. I honestly am obsessed with this coloring and everything. It just looks so pretty. I love the flavor. Like I said, really great if you're not into super sweet things. If you are into sweet things, just add a little bit more rosemary simple syrup and you're, you'll be good to go. Sorry, I'm like salivating because it's like so like, I don't know, delicious, I guess. <laughs> I'm just like about to spit onto the cutting board, which isn't great, but whatever. My kitchen, or my house. You will notice, I forgot to mention this, we are not in the kitchen right now. We are recording in my living room right now, <laughs> just because it looked, I don't know, nice and festive and Christmassy, and it was a lot less effort to try to decorate the kitchen. This is the second time I'm recording this, to be super honest with you. First time I recorded it in the kitchen, it looked like we were in Soviet Russia and it was not very festive, so today, we make very festive. I always do like an Eastern European accent. I do have Eastern European heritage, so maybe that is why. It is my people. Merry Christmas, enjoy. I smile too much to be Eastern European. So yeah, that is the Christmas wreath. I, oh. <laughs> Sorry, we're in a leather skirt, so it like makes a lot of sound. I just like flashed you a little bit. Sorry. Ooh, buy me a drink first. Oh wait, I already made it. Anyway, so this is a Christmas wreath. I hope you enjoy it. Oh, like I said, if you want to make this into a cocktail, just add like a shot or two of vodka, depending on how salsa you want to go. And that is really good. When I was drinking alcohol, that's what I was doing. And it was awesome. There you go. Or you can add some other, Oh. My cranberries are popping out. My cranberries! So yeah, that's the Christmas wreath. Um, I hope you enjoy it. And like I said, recipe is, I'm like still spitting, I'm sorry. <laughs> like I said, recipes on my website at amariandrew.com, linked in the description below. Check out my web website, oh, Jesus Christ. You can also check out my website for all these recipes, but what I was, but what I was gonna say is that uh, all these other recipes, all the other mocktail slash cocktail recipes are gonna be on my channel as well, so go check them out. Like this video if you like this recipe or if you like my sweater. Happy holidays, have a great Christmas or whatever you celebrate. Have a great December festivity month. I think I just wanna call it that from now on because like I like celebrating things even though I'm not religious at all, but I don't know, it's just fun. Like parties are fun, celebrating things is fun. Anywho, that's the Christmas wreath. I hope you have a happy December and happy new year and just happy life in general and I I will talk to you in the next video or just wherever I see you next. Okay, bye! Happy, happy, happy time. <laughs> Can't sweat in my sweater. I guess I can. I'm wearing a sweater. Let's fucking go! Dancing to the music in my head. Do you have music in your head? Probably not, because sane people don't.